Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Brianna Hightower. And in today's video, this video has been so highly, highly requested. To be honest, I've been nervous to make this video. I feel like I could go on and on seriously about this subject all day, which is why I'm just going to do a pretty basic overview of what I'm talking about in this video. And then if you guys want more, request it and I can dive into specifics. But um, yeah, today's video is how I um, have been able to make money on social media. And again, I'm going to talk about four to five different ways that I personally make money on social media. There are so many of these videos and I feel like so many are, are so misleading um make 3k in a week on social media make this i tell y'all right now only way i'm making that much on social media like off the jump is if i go ahead and like start this only fans and i'm not doing that all right we are we i tell you right now only fans is not going to be in this video <laughs> period period um so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and get right into it. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content. Um, I upload about two videos weekly, trying to get better, trying to get a more consistent schedule. But you know, if you're not new here, you know your girl's life is, woo! But okay, let's go ahead and jump right into the video. So we all have different reasons why we might want to start making money on social media. Um, you know, just for that little bit of extra income. I guess no one's really complaining about making extra money. But what I think a lot of people do not realize is that doing like social media um, content creation, whatever you want to call it, is honestly like a full-time job. Um, if you're like me and you have a regular, you know, I guess you would say nine to five full-time job. Doing this on the side is one, I'm okay, so first tips off the jump. This is not an easy way to make money. Being a social media um, influencer, whatever you wanna call it, content creator, it is not an easy way to make money and you are not going to make money fast. So if you clicked on this video for me to tell you you're gonna make money fast and it's gonna be so easy, some people are blessed, but I'm telling you right now, I've been doing social media influencing and content creation since 2017. And I will say 2020 is the first year that I've made enough to where I have to like, you know, um, I, do, I do taxes on social media now and so on and so forth. And this is my first year that I have ever even made enough to even have to think about doing that. Um, so I just want to start the video with that. This is not an easy uh get money quick thing and it is not like it is a full-time job almost you know so if you already have a full-time job you need to make sure a you have the time for to do this you know instagram and you know social media influencing so just wanted to start there all right, so let's go ahead and get into um, how I'm actually able to bring an income off of social media. Um, I feel like it's very important to first, I got started into this. So just really quick, a brief interview like of how I got started into this. Um, back in 2017, I was in um, active duty military and I literally was at a fitness expo one day and I was walking around and you know, I had been on Instagram, you know, like I think at that time I had like a couple thousand followers, like three or 4,000 followers on Instagram just from being myself, being personable and just posting my life, so on and so forth. Um, and then I actually was there at a fitness expo in Bang Energy, like the energy drink company um, was there and they were having model tryouts and all my friends were like, you should totally go try out. And so very long story short, I can go into that in a different video if you guys want specifics on really how I got in with Bang, but um, I got chosen to be a Bang Energy model and from there, that is where all of my like um, really Instagram based uh, influencing content creation got started. And then now I um, mainly do um, Instagram, uh, YouTube, of course, and then I do a lot of like um, affiliate linking sites and thinking of starting a Patreon here soon, but all right. So let's go ahead and really for sure let's dive get into how I'm actually making money. So the first thing, the first two things are pr primarily on Instagram. And my biggest one is going to be um, brand deals and collaborations. So that is gonna be my number one and two. So I just wanna tell you guys. So at this point, I am making money off of brand deals and collaborations. But was I always making money off of those? No. When I first started, I took a lot of collaborations just for free product. And I need you guys to understand, you know, do not, 
don't sell yourself short. I I know how hard it is for content creation and people get paid a buku money for it. But in the beginning, don't be afraid to like just take free product because I promise you just taking that free product and giving really, really good reviews can lead to companies paying you as you grow. And so, like I said, that's don't be afraid to also take like things that, that you genuinely want as, you know, monetary value. But so collaborations, um, collaborations are going to be. So if a company reaches out to you and they're like, hey, we'd love to send you, you know, this product. And if you could like do a review on your main Instagram feed or on your story. Um, and so the thing with collaborations is I used to just always take free product and Sometimes I will still take free products because it's still you're getting a free like nice item Typically that um, brand will like post you on their page Which is also helping your page grow which that's why I said do not be afraid to take those especially if it's a Brand with a lot of followers because they can repost you and then that's really helping you in the long run but with collaborations at the point where I'm at now on Instagram with over 20,000 followers, I, I charge. And if you want to know more about like contracts and finding out how much you're worth, like I said, please comment below because I can do full videos on it. But I basically did some research online, figured out for how many followers I had and my engagement on my posts because you can easily look up your Instagram and find out exactly what your engagement is. Anyone can do that. Um, and I basically found out that I am worth anywhere in between 200 to like $220 per Instagram post. So when brands reach out to me and they say, you know, how much do you charge per Instagram post? Again, this number is always going up with the more followers and more engagement that I, I'm getting as I grow. And I just tell them like, this is my, I send them my contract. This is my contract. This is how much I charge. And then I, I will negotiate pricing, you know, depending on what the product is that they're sending me. But that is a kind of the first way I make money is collaborations. Um, people wanting to just send me things and me do reviews. And like I said in the beginning, it's perfectly fine. I still do it a lot. I just take product and I'll do reviews if it's something that I'm interested in, something that I want. And I feel like it's also, you know, gonna benefit me on the back end in terms of it like followers. However, normally I am going to charge because I am taking the time out of my day to do this content creation with my audience who I've worked extremely hard to build and so charge. So collaborations are gonna be the first way. Uh, brand deals. Now brand deals, in my opinion, are different than collaborations. A brand deal is gonna be when a company reaches out to you and they want to like have you sign a contract that you're gonna work with them long term. For me, the brand deal that I have, um, I have one, and it is with a workout apparel company called Curves and Combat Boots. Curves and Combat Boots has changed my life. They have really completely changed my life. If you are looking into getting serious into content creation, a brand deal is what you want to strive for. And the first step of getting a brand deal is going to figure out, okay, what brand do you love? That honestly was for me, I knew that my page was always like surrounded around um, health, like healthy lifestyle and fitness. That's always been what my main page has always been like surrounded around, right? Um, and this is over on my Instagram again. On here, you guys get a lot of like lifestyle breed, that kind of content, but my Instagram has always pretty much been a lot like centered around fitness and just lifestyle. Um, so, I was looking for brands that fit that when I realized that um, Bang Energy was not going to be that for me. Um, I just kind of thought maybe, you know, I would take a break from it and then Curves and Combat Boots came around. There's multiple ways that you can get brand deals. You can reach out to brands yourself. Um, basically all brands have like PR teams, so teams that go out and find like influencers and people that can, you know, spread awareness about their brand via social media. So uh, sometimes brand reps will reach out to you. In my case, Curves and Combat Boots, they reached out to me, which has been the biggest blessing and I'll go in a minute why. Um, but you know, and same with Bang, Bang, I went up and auditioned to be a model and, and I got chosen, which their models are brand ambassadors starting. There's different tiers. Um, but yeah, so you also can reach out to companies. I have reached out to companies for collaborations and also brand deals. Um, loungewear, a huge um, like undergarments company that's out of the UK. 
I reached out to them literally like once a month for almost a year and then finally one of their PFs, uh, PR reps got back to me so that they reviewed my Instagram and they brought me on to like their PR team. So I don't have a brand deal with them, but I collab with them every once in a while. I'm on their PR list so they will send me products. I don't get paid for loungewear, but they send me products, but I do that because they have millions of followers. So one repost from a company like that I mean, that's huge for a small, I consider myself still, a, you know, kind of a small creator. So um, yeah, that's a little bit about collaborations and brand deals now. Like I said, don't hesitate to reach out to these companies, send them a professional email, like a professional email on the best email address for you. Tell them what your name is, you know, what you are contacting them for, how many followers you currently have. Give them a little bit about yourself, why you like their brand. You will honestly be so surprised how many influencers, and I mean big influencers, still reach out to brands for brand deals. And the way that I make money off of my brand deal with Curves and Combat Boots, and this is majority of brand deals, is um, so commissionable links is one way. So majority of brand deals, when you're signed with them, you're gonna have a commissionable link. So you have a link anytime someone shops with it, you're gonna get a certain percentage. Some percentages are as low, you know, they can be like five to 10%. Some go all the way up to 30%. Um, mine is, you know, disclosed in a contract, but I will just say with curves, you know, and I do have people who are supporting me. I wouldn't be making any money without you guys, seriously. And they're using my link to buy this clothing, but um, curves is where I make the bulk of my money monthly on social media. And it has been such a blessing. And so I'm, like I said, I make them through those links, um, going to do team photo shoots and everything. Um, getting paid for different events and stuff like that. So especially with Bang Energy, I used to get paid for every event that I went to, I would get like a paycheck for that. So every brand's gonna be different, but brand deals are a huge way that you can get like a consistent monthly paycheck as to where um, collaborations kind of just whenever they come and you'll get that money whenever, okay? So again, you guys are seeing, it is not going to be consistent. I've had months where I have made over a thousand dollars on social media strictly i've had months where i've made like a couple hundred bucks so like i said not easy money not quick money it's very sporadic money all over the place money but hey it's money and if it's something that you really want to try and do and get into then take the plunge um all right next is going to be so the commissionable links so when I say commissionable links, I mean that there are many platforms, but the one I use is called Like To Know It, um, along with Reward Style. Um, could do a whole entire video on Like To Know It. Let me know if you guys want to, but um, it is co commissionable links. So all of like my outfits, um, different like makeup I wear, um, my, my different hair that I wear, you can go on to this site and you can link everything like home goods. They have so they have like literally over like 500 stores that you can go on there. Um, so I basically just link like all my day to day stuff. I was always having people say, where'd you get that sweater? Where'd you get this wig from? What, what lipstick are you wearing? This and that. So now when people ask me that, or, you know, if I just take a good picture and I want to go link everything, you can just go into apps and link it. And if someone buys it, like using, you know, your link, you get direct commission. It's seriously so simple. But again, I've had really good months where I've made, um, when you're talking about just these links, I think the most I've made is like five or $600 a month. So, you know, you'll have months like that. And then I've literally had months where I make like under $100 on my commissionable links. It really just depends on the month, depends on, you know, what kind of products you're posting. But that is another way that I personally make money off commissionable links is doing that. So the next one is going to be what I'm doing right now, YouTube. So I personally am not monetized yet on YouTube. I have made zero dollars, zero cents, zip, zip, zero on YouTube so far to this day. But I do wanna just talk about it a little bit because a lot of people are making monthly paychecks from YouTube. I am extremely close. The time you guys see this video, I am probably like, uh, hopefully like, 20 and under uh, subscribers away from being monetized. Um, I've already hit all the other requirements that YouTube like sets out for you. I just need to get the subscribers now. Um, but yeah, so YouTube is a way people are getting a monthly paycheck. Like I said, 
it's very sporadic and also you need to make sure you are saving money for taxes with all of this stuff not just youtube please make sure you understand that if you hit a certain level of this influencing you are going to have to pay taxes on it so make sure you are putting some of that money aside it's very very important it's key um but yeah youtube basically you get a monthly paycheck your paycheck is based off quite a few things um i can link some videos down below that will better describe how you make money off of youtube but it's based off of you know your your views your watch hours um, how many people are clicking on your videos and then YouTube generates you a monthly paycheck based on those numbers. So that is another way that a lot of people do make money off of social media. And my last way is going to be if you are someone with a niche, use that niche. So I, like I said, health and fitness. So back when my life was a lot less busy than it is now with a child and a family and everything. Um, I one day wanted to make an e-guide. I wanted to make an e-workout guide with an eight-week plan. Um, I did not know how this plan would do, and at the time, I was not a certified, I'm still not a certified um, like coach, which to me is very important, which is why I have not made a guide since. But at that time, I made that guide just to see how, you know, if people would be interested in it. I literally made $1,700 off selling these workout guides and I made $1,700 in a little under a month. Um, I couldn't imagine, especially with all the knowledge that I have now, which is way more than I had then, um, how much I can make off making an e-guide, an e-book. And I know I've seen this in a lot of videos, but you know, it's true, but this is one that, you know, if you have a niche, this is for you. If you are talented at something, you feel like you can put into like a like a ebook or a, a blog form and sell it to people do it that that's actually why i'm thinking of making this patreon account it'll be a monthly subscription for women who want to get more one-on-one -on -one fitness guidance and more one-on-one -on -one workouts and fitness advice with me they'll pay a monthly subscription and they'll get all of that that people on my instagram aren't getting on a consistent basis and they'll, they'll get more so that's a huge one. If you have a niche or something that you can sell or put in like, like I said, like an ebook form or even making a Patreon, having people subscribe monthly for something that a service you can provide. I mean, you're, you can really do well on social media, especially right now in this COVID-19 time. People are doing a lot of stuff online and are making a lot of money online because people aren't out doing as many things in person. All right, guys, um, I hope I didn't ramble. I have a tendency of rambling and I do hope that you found this video at least helpful. I, like I said, I really just wanted to tell you guys the way that I do, I personally am making money on social media, um, or how I have made money on social media, um, I know that this video is, you know, short, it's very broad, and I'm 100% willing to answer more specific questions. So I actually am filming a video um, this week on some questions I got on my Instagram specifically about this, like making money on social media, doing content creation. So if you have any more questions, please put, and you haven't already told me on Instagram, please comment down below, put the questions, and I will gladly add them into that video. So, all right, guys, um, let's make this money in 2021 continue making these boss moves and i will see you guys in the next one